Hey everyone, this is Frugal Panda here with a review of the Jackery Explorer 160. Before I begin, I want to thank everyone who went to my links within YouTube and purchased different things. Um, because of that, I was able to pick this up. And I thank you very much. That was very much appreciated. So this is the Jackery Explorer 160. This is the smallest Jackery that you can actually buy. Um, it's 167 watts of hours of power of energy storage. So it has 167 watt hours, which is 46,400 mAh. It's a lithium ion battery. It, uh, it's, it's the smallest one. It's tiny. I picked this up for one of the good reasons is to say I want to do a one day or just a trip, say in my car, road trip, but I don't want to take my huge blue Eddie. I've had one of these before. I gave it to my son and really never really got to use it because he does uh, wildfire uh, firefighters in the summer. So I gave him one to be able to keep his phone charged and everything, my old one. So I went with this again. One, Blue Eddy does not, I could not find one this small with Blue Eddy. And two, I, I know the build quality of the Jackeries and the Jackeries are also well built. And the 160 is a pretty cheap one. It's like 130 or so dollars for the 160. The 160 of course does not hold the power of Blue Eddy, but this is not a comparison between the two. They're totally different in regards to size, you know, things like that, what they can hold. This is, like I said, perfect if I wanted to go on a road trip in regards to I didn't want to take the Blue Eddy. Maybe I wasn't taking my refrigerator. I wasn't going to have my refrigerator plugged into something like this all the time. It might be plugged into my car and then maybe in a hotel or, you know, whatever. This is a perfect size for camping if you're not taking a bunch of stuff that takes a lot of wattage. It's great for your rechargeable lights, your flashlights, your phone. Um, this little thing can power a lot of different things and you throw a solar panel with it and it's great. But the size of it is what make, is really important for me. Like I said, you can put this in your car, you can put it in your backpack, you know, you can do all types of stuff with it. Two USBs, USB-C has on it, different outputs and AC and DC. I think it's really good. Uh, you know, it has the standard DC 12 volt port, you know, and it does work with a solar charger, or excuse me, with a solar panel easily. I have a 60 watt, works great with it. You can even, and I've done it with the Jackery, I did it with the Blue Eddy too, you could charge off a larger power bank. So say I could charge this off my Blue Eddy EBS, uh, EB700S or whatever. I could charge it off of there. So say I had that plugged in to my solar panels charging, I could plug this in and have this fully charged and both of them be charging off partially off the solar panels. It has a built-in LED. You can see it comes with stickers. Um, I like stickers. That's <laughs> why so I saw the stickers. I said, oh, cool, stickers. You know, like I said, lightweight. It comes with the cigarette lighter and the charger and the uh, plug-in charger for your wall. So you can charge it off your car. Then you can charge it when you're in a hotel or in your house or whatever. And it's very quiet when it charges. Uh, so that's one thing to keep, um, keep in to con think about in consideration of this one. As you can see, that's my 60 watt solar panel. I'll put a link in the description and it uses the same exact, exact adapters to Blue Eddy. The Blue Eddies and the Jackeries a lot of times use the same exact adapter. The 240 uses the same as the 160, the 500, etc. As you can see, I did it on an overcast day, which I didn't really care. It wasn't the point of this. I was just doing a review. It would charge up to 60 watts and that can be verified um, very easily. I've done it before. So this, that little Jackery, because of its size, would charge really fast. As you can see right there, the Blue Eddy's practically dead, but I could use it, had it plugged in, so you, everyone can see too. So to verify, it was just getting out two watts of power to solar panel due to the overcast and being late in the day. Of course, you can charge your um, laptop off of it. So say you take your laptop with you, you're camping or whatever, like I said, you could have the solar panel plugged in and have your, your laptop in your tent or whatever and your Jackery and just be charging both of them at the same time. I think it's a win-win, especially for the price. Now, as far as using it with the CPAP, I'm not for sure if this would um, actually charge or, excuse me, keep a CPAP running all through the night. A 240 should, but a 160, uh, you can do the calculations on it and figure out how much wattage your CPAP uses and divide it and, you know, all that. There's a whole formula you can do. Now, with the 1AC, it can charge at 110 volts at, um, excuse me, 100 watts with 150 watts of peak power. So that's something to keep into consideration. So if you have anything over 150 watt peak power, it may not be able to, you may not be able to use the AC outlet on it. I really like this one. I think it's really great in regards to, it's just the size of it. I mean, but it's still good. 
And it does not have the Jackeries, as I know right now, do not have a LiPo, sir, uh, LiPo 4 uh, batteries in them. And if you know anything about the LiPo 4 batteries, that has to do with how many cycles you can you can actually char uh, charge this, recharge this at um, before it starts losing it, um, the the amount of um, power that it will hold. It's similar to just like a lithium ion, same as a car, electric car. So I know the Blue Eddy, and I'm not talking about the Blue Eddy in comparison, I'm talking about the batteries more. So the batteries in it are supposed to have a longer life cycle, like double or triple or whatever, that of a re the regular lithium ion battery, say in the Jackery. But that does not take away from the quality of the Jackery. This is still a great um, um, charger, or excuse me, power bank for you. Trust me on that. Jackeries are good power banks. Um, I really like the 160, I like the 240, and I like the 300. But uh, thanks to everyone who purchased things through Amazon, I saw this and I pay basically picked it up after all the, after I got the gift certificate from people clicking on my links and purchasing whatever they purchased on Amazon, I got it for like 20 bucks. Who would have turned down a Jackery for 20 bucks? Exactly. Like I said, build quality is awesome. Um... When I go, I'm going to take a short camping trip when I don't want to take everything with me. This will be going with me. Most definitely, I'll take this and a couple of my little bitty power banks. And this meets all my needs. I can run my LED lights. I can run my fans. I can do so much stuff with the little guy. As you saw, I put both of them side by side so you can just see a size comparison. That Blue Eddy is a chunk. As you can see right now, it's charging. Um off of the two 160 so the blue eddy is actually charging off the 160 and vice versa i charged the blue eddy uh the jackery 160 off the blue eddy too here's the foldable panels and you can see how it folds up it's pretty easy so if anybody's interested those 60 watts i think 60 watts is plenty like i said i've tested it out camping and it was plenty of, um I got plenty of juice for all my stuff while I was camping for several days. So no issues with that. And I like the form factor, how it folds up. You can hold it. Do I recommend the Jackery 160? Yes, I do. Especially if you're on a budget, especially if you're someone that's not trying to run a TV and all that type of stuff. The Jackery is perfect for you. The small 160 It's the form factor. You know, it's the size of it. They're known for good quality. They always make good quality products. All the, all the Jackeries I had, I never had an issue with them. Um, so if you want this, I'll leave a link in the description. Like I said, great size. You can charge all your stuff at the, you know, you charge things to multiple at the same time. So you have multiple items. Anyway, everyone, I want to thank you for watching and I appreciate everyone that takes the time. The Jackery 160 is a good buy. If this is maybe a little too small for you, then go with the 240 or the 300. Not too much bigger. Definitely not as big as the Blue Eddy. So it won't take up a lot of room in your vehicle, you know, etc. Good quality, as you know, with Jackery.